Hey, how's it going, Kevin? This is Douglas James. Thanks for taking the time out of your day to watch this video presentation that I made for you. So in this video, I am going to show you guys exactly um, what we're going to do for you as far as Google AdWords campaign. I'm going to show you exactly how much business we can generate for you with the budget that you gave me. Um, and then I'm also going to talk to you about some other options that we also can offer you. All right. So I'm just going to jump right into the video here. All right, so here is your website. So like I said, um, pretty much what I'm going to be going over is PPC, okay, and that's the Google AdWords portion. So um, right now, pretty much you guys are targeting the United States. Um, so, you know, every month around 3.8 million times to 4 million times a month, you know, 3 to 4 million times a month, you know, students are going to school, they need cash, they need to uh, get their books, what have you. Um, so Google tells us all of the most profitable keywords to target to get uh, business for your uh, for your company, right? The most profitable one is student loans. This keyword alone generates so much business, um, and it's highly targeted by a lot of competitors. So for this keyword, um, what's going on here? What you're seeing is we've I've actually built out a plan. So if we're bidding at $22 per click, okay, at $22 per click, um, it's going to give us roughly 2,000 clicks, right? 21, 2,200 uh, clicks. Um, and the cost is saying it's going to be 21,000 here, all right? But that's at $10 average per click. So I have built this calculator, me and my partners built this calculator. Um, that determines exactly roughly how much you should make with your investment every month. So for student, for this one keyword, student loans, um, at 2,100 clicks a month, and at the at that bid rate at $10 per click, the traffic value is 21,000, right? That's what Google's telling us. But let me break this down for you. So you're going to get 2,100 visitors to your site per month, right? Um, the actual, or the 2,100 visitors you're going to get impressions on, right? Um, actual traffic capture is going to be 15%. Let's just say 15%. This number can range 5 to 37. Let's lowball it. Target, you want to be 30%. We're, we have it set for 15%. Okay, so the actual people that we have on your site every month is 315. Okay, and of those, we're going to say 15%. This is average, okay? 15% are actually going to turn into leads. So you have about 47, 50 leads that's going to actually contact you with, and, and to look for a loan, all right? Um, say your sales conversion is 25%. Now you have about 12 sales, okay, per month with this plan, all right? Um, so I did some research and figured out some numbers on how much each lead is worth to you. So um, according to um, my loan calculator here, so let's just say the average loan is 30000 and you guys are getting four points, all right? So at a 10-year long term, that's about $6,400, okay? So that's how I... Uh, priced it out so we can definitely you know reach back out if you want to really dial down some real numbers but I put it in each leads worth 6400 so the gross monthly income is 75 grand now here's your hard cost for that 20 percent because this calculator is built out so that you're making at least 400 percent ROI um, every single month all right, so if you put in X amount of mon money, we, we you're expected to make this amount of money. So your hard cost is fifteen one fifteen thousand one hundred twenty dollars to make this. All right, and that's going to keep you above and at the four hundred percent mark. We want to we want you to obviously make money right from this. So we have built this to make you money. Um, so your monthly revenue that you made was sixty sixty five. All right, 60500 So that's built off of this plan. So that's at a $15,000 investment per month. And that's how much you're going to be making. Now, this number can be different. This 6400 you know, with, with 
whatever your loan rates are um, and your your payment options, you know, 5, 10, 15 years, however you guys do it. I did this based off this calculator to give you an idea. All right. So um, once we have acquired that lead, okay, once we pull them in from, you know, if they type in student loans here, and once we took them from these ads that were posted, we don't want to, we could send them to your website, okay, which is this one, studentfinancialhelp.com. Um, I did click this button's not working, this eligibility button. So we would want to get that fixed. But what I want to recommend to you as a part of this process, if you're going to send someone somewhere to get information online, you want to send them to a very, uh, a uh, appropriate attractive landing page to acquire that information so I went ahead and build out I built out this landing page to give you an idea of what we can do for you so once they come to this landing page student loans now landing page okay this will be coming straight from the Google ad campaign right um, welcome to the student financial help center you know enter your information receive a free student loan consultation all right pretty easy name email phone number city state and zip because you're going to be targeting the whole country and then at the bottom here what we're doing is we're creating some uh emotion so would you like us to send would you like us to send a free report of our student payment options yes i'd love that or no i'm good thanks most likely they're going to say yes right so we want to get some emotion out of them to commit their information to give you guys the consult and then get my consult now you guys have your information there's two ways we can give you this uh, information we you're going to get it in a you know email old school way or we can uh, we can set up a direct transfer so our phone program can grab whatever uh, phone numbers here and set up an instant phone call to you and your call center so you can be connected with your new lead immediately versus them you know contacting one of your competitors right after they submit their information so we can do it like this and then we can also add um, if we wanted you know a phone number and we could actually customize this out uh, a little bit more and add a phone number uh, to you guys and then maybe a link to the site but we what we really want to do is we want to generate leads so this method that i'm showing you right now is actually going to generate you a lot more leads to your business than just 15 percent all right this is a low ball number this is when you're sending someone to a website like yours okay and they're having to search and search for the contact information they're scrolling through the page there's a contact information now is this number clickable if i'm on a mobile device is it clickable because 80 percent of your customers are going to be looking at um you know your website through a mobile device all right so they're going to have to click this this doesn't work yet um they're going to have to go over to the contact page uh, you know, look the number up. They could fill this out pretty easy, right? So we want to send them to something that's attractive that they're going to want to re really reach out. And that's why I'm really recommending we build out a custom landing page that is really attractive, simple for them to, to put in their information versus just sending them to a website and having them click through a bunch of pages to find your information. Maybe it's just clicking one page, but still, um, you literally have two seconds to convert somebody when they hit your website. So if they have to go click somewhere to find you, your chances goes down that much more. But if they click directly and brought straight to a page that's ready to take their information to get a consult set up because they're ready, these guys are ready to be serviced and ready to go, that's going to be a lot better for you and your conversion rates. So this number is going to be a lot higher. I just lowballed this to give you an idea, but this will be a lot higher if you go with this method. All right, so that is the PPC campaign that I put together for you all right so a lot of leads per month and we're not just going to target student loans um, Google like I said gives us all of the keywords that we can target all right so I want to show you like the top guy pretty much in the country and you're probably familiar is uh, Sally Mae okay so I did a little spying on Sally Mae and this is them right so these guys are spending around two hundred thirty thousand dollars a month in in uh, PPC and Google AdWords. All right, so this is their campaign. 
they're getting around you know fifty to sixty thousand uh, visitors per month. Okay, that's huge. But look at what I'm able to do. I'm able to target the keywords that they're going after. So obviously, student loans is going to be number one. Uh, college scholarship, apply for college uh, for college, apply for scholarships, private student loans. Okay. So we can see which keywords they're getting the most business in. So in student loans, they're getting um, a lot of action, over 88,000 from that one keyword. Um, but I'm also able to go in here into my tool. This is going to take a moment um, and find out exactly how much, how, what keywords they're using. So we can find out it's already tested and proven by your competitor which keywords are the most um, successful. So look, it gives me all of their keywords. So top keyword group, Sally Mae, of course, they're a big company, but student loans, again, is the number one keyword. So that's the keyword that you want to go for. All right. So I'm able to target all the keywords and find out where your competitors are at. This is going to be very useful information as I move forward to build your PPC campaign and then going back and then figuring out exactly uh, which ones also here some long tail words that we can also target okay so that is the the Google AdWords all right so the other thing I wanted to show you was Facebook so what I want to do you know you're gonna be roughly if we do the full 20,000 um, a month. Okay, this is built for full twenty thousand. If you guys wanted to start with, uh, you know, ten or fifteen a month, that's cool. We'll just scale it down, but you'll still be getting the four hundred percent because we're going to make sure you get at least four hundred percent on your investment at the minimum. Um, what I want to do is I want to take twenty percent and offer you. We don't have to do this, but take twenty percent of whatever you invest and do Facebook with it. All right, because Facebook, we're actually able to target these students that are that need these loans. So um, I, I put this ad together just to show you the targeting capability of Facebook. So I did for United States, um, ages 16 to 25, because that's probably going to be the most common age group that you're going to be dealing with, maybe 15. Okay, and I've actually already identified all the most profitable, relevant, uh, keyword uh, targeting for demographic and interest. So we got college grad, uh, college um, education, high school learning, Sally May, you know, interest in that, student aid, student loan, uh, loan support. So I've, I've already cross referenced and identified these as the best ones to target. Um, and as you can see, we've, we're in the good to go meter, we're in green, and with this ad, we're going to actually be able to, um, I'm trying to show you right over here, estimated daily reach is going to be 20,000 to 53,000 people, okay, on Facebook, all right, and I've written this ad, we've had the best success on Facebook ads at not using audience network, not using Instagram, and not using the right column of Facebook because that those positions people do not convert from and it's a way for Facebook to really eat your money up. So the only thing we do is Facebook feed on mobile devices and center the page. We don't do anything else. All right, so we get the max uh, amount of conversions, and we have this set up for $100 a day. So out of a month, um, this is going to be $3,000 of, of your budget, roughly. So that's what I have it kind of set up. So right now, with the PPC campaign that I, that I showed you, you're around fifteen grand, and with this, you're around three grand. So that's about eighteen grand. so a little bit shorter on your budget. All right, so that's kind of like what I put together, and I think I know that this is going to be a very uh, successful campaign for you guys. Um, and like I told you, whatever leads that we acquire, we're going to want to send them to a landing page like this, whether it be from Facebook or from Google AdWords. Um, we just want to get their information right away. We don't want them searching through a website. Um, this is going to be the best thing for you guys a custom built landing page. All right. So that's my two options for you guys. Um, that's the initial um, investment. 
you know, of course we can scale that up and down. It's up to you guys. Just let me know what you want to do, but you're looking at around 18 grand. Um, our, uh, charge for fee is 15%. So whatever budget you guys have, um, our charge is 15% to manage, manage the budget and, and to run the ads and everything that goes with it. So 15% is our, is our fee. Um, so the last thing I want to talk to you about, and it's something that you may want to do down the line is, um, SEO. All right. So I tried to get some data back, um, for you guys, you know, as you know, you know, Google is huge. There's a reason why you're on it right now. Um, and looking to get business, it's because over 80% of the population is on Google and 96% click on the very first page, right? So I wanted to get some data back. I, obviously, I couldn't find y'all on any uh, searches. So let me pull this up. I didn't find you on any searches for student loans. Okay. Um but I wanted to show you if you wanted to go down that road, what that looks like. So right now the site, I can't get any traffic data back from, from uh, SEM rush or spy There's no data here. Okay. Um, the main thing with SEO for you guys, the biggest thing is going to be content. All right. So on your website, what we're going to have to do if we go down this road is build at least 2000 words on the home page um, and every keyword the most profitable keyword that you guys want to rank for say student loan student loan company um, you know apply for student loans we're gonna want to build out a separate page on your site and rank it and put at least 1500 to 2000 words on that page to rank that page but mainly the home page we're gonna want 2000 words with all of the keywords okay that that I mentioned all right, that's going to be the first thing. Um, then this, the second thing is the backlinks. All right, that's going to be what, what gets you ranked number one. Um, and this is uh, a profile of your current backlink. So as you can see, everything's zero. So that pretty much we're starting from scratch. Um, an influence link or backlink is kind of like, uh, you know, SEO is what you say about your business online, what everybody else says about your business online. So this is a vote. So the more votes you have, the more chances you're going to rank. So Google wants to give you votes. Um, so right now you don't have any domain. So let me show you. Um, this is the number one company right now for student loan. Okay. These guys right here, eStudentLoan.com. They're pretty much number one. Huffington Post doesn't count. All right. So... <sighs> So they're, they have 91 referring domains. That's their uh, websites mentioning them online. Their trust flow is 61. Okay. So if you look at this chart, anything over 20 is high quality. Now, when you're dealing with these big companies like this and uh, college websites, um, they are going to be very difficult. The, the, as you can see, they're off the charts. Okay. So what's going to happen is what we can do to rank you, it's going to take a year. And this is down the road, um, but we, what we want to do is we've done this. We've launched um, university campaigns or scholarship campaigns. So what we do is we contact. It's just funny that you guys are actually in that realm of student loan and dealing with students and colleges. We've actually done this for any niche, like solar companies and roofing companies and stuff. But what we do is um, we run a scholarship campaign and we contact, you know, 500 colleges in the country and say, hey, we're giving out a thousand dollar scholarship to a student that can write, um, you know, like for our solar company, we did why solar panels are, are a better energy source than electricity or why solar panels are changing in the future. And it would just be a 500 word essay. You know, we would get like 50 to a hundred students that would submit their scholarship uh, or their essay. And uh, we would choose the top five, put them on social media. Whoever got the most likes and comments wins, right? Um, so once we select the winner, we let the school know, you know, Miss John Doe, Mr. John Doe, you know, won the scholarship. They're going to put a link on their website and mention you and write about the program and write about the student. Um, so this is going to be your, your link and it's going to be coming from high authoritative sites. Like, let me show you Harvard. Okay. So if you get a link from 
say Harvard, anything that's .edu or .gov, government websites, are huge. All right, so I'm going to take you off of here and just show you the power of these sites. So you'll get a link from these guys. Look, Trustflow 77, okay, and they have 26,000. Um, so that's the type of power you'll be getting from your site. So if you guys wanted to rank and do a scholarship campaign, that's how we're going to get you super powerful sites. Right now, the links that we can provide you are very powerful. They're all over 30 and 35. Um, and it's uh, dumb PBNs and domains that we own that we can like, what, we, can, we could start working on your website, but I'm telling you it's going to take a year. And to do it, we're going to need these powerful links because there are some really uh, heavy hitters um, in your market. Okay. Um, and that's, you know, these guys, the e-student loan and the uh, Sally Mae, very high powerful sites. So that's just an option down the road if you guys are interested. So I'm glad I was able to give you, that pretty much concludes my analysis on the uh, PPC. So I hope it makes sense for you guys. Um, I really know, I really believe that the uh, AdWords campaign that we can put together for you guys and then combine with the Facebook, um, what I want to do is you know, figure out, you know, we'll run it for a month or two. Let's compile some data after 90 days, figure out which one's given us the better conversions, um, whether it be Facebook or the AdWords, and then invest fully into that one option. Or just keep running both of them, you know, be on multiple platforms at once um, and, and pull leads. You know, the, the, more, uh, the more you put yourself out there, the more leads that you guys are going to get. So, again, Kevin, I really appreciate the time. My name is Douglas James, and you have a great day. Reach out. You have my contact information right here. Give me a call, and let's chat about this. Thanks. Bye-bye.